When you have water damage on your wall, it is essential to get to the source of the problem and take action immediately. You can do this by calling a professional water restoration service, and by using the non-invasive moisture meter and an IR camera. The IR camera can detect the presence of moisture without cutting holes in the wall. After the damage has been identified, you will need to dry the wall and surrounding materials. A professional can also use specialized drying equipment to remove the water stains from the walls and prevent them from spreading. One of the most obvious signs of water damage on a wall is bubbling or staining. Those two signs are common. In most cases, the cause of the water damage is a leak, which can be from a split water pipe, a leaky tank, or even damage to the roof. You will need to check the plumbing to determine whether a leak is causing the problem. If you are not sure if there is a leak, you can check the water meter to make sure it is not a gas leak. When you find a leak, you must determine where it came from. If the leak is inside the home, water will travel to far areas of the home and cause damage. You may not even know where the leak is coming from if it is in a wall or ceiling. In addition, you must contact a licensed plumber to determine the exact source of the leak. You need to get a professional who can help you with the repair and the cleanup. A professional can save you time and money and ensure that you and your family stay safe. When the water damage is hidden, you may not see it immediately. The only way to know for sure that it has occurred is to call a water damage restoration company. In order to avoid mold and mildew, you should get rid of the affected materials and dry the area. A professional can handle all the repairs and mold removal. If you're not sure what to do, you can always hire a professional. This will ensure that your property is safe. If the interior wall is soaked and you can see the mold, you can use the ready mix compound on it. It will not be as hard as you want it to be. In addition, it will not prevent mold from growing. The best way to dry the wall is to use a moisture meter. If you have an alarmingly strong musty smell, you need to contact a water damage restoration company right away. When you have water damage on wall, you have to take action immediately. You should immediately contact a water damage service to assess the level of damage and determine whether it can be repaired yourself. A professional can help you assess the extent of the damage and determine the necessary repairs. After the water damage, you should remove the drywall with a dehumidifier and towels. To dry the wall, you should use a dehumidifier to remove the moisture. When you have water damage on wall, you should take immediate action to repair the problem as quickly as possible. You should check if there are discolored or bubbled drywall. You should also check if the drywall has become soft and cracked. If you notice any of these signs, contact a water damage repair service and try to get the drywall repaired. The damage could be more serious than you think. If the wall has been compromised, you should have it inspected. If you notice water damage on wall, you should try to find the source of the problem. If you can't locate the source of the water, you should first look for signs of a leak. If the water has penetrated the foundation, you should start by repairing the wall. Afterwards, you should clean the damaged part. The damaged parts should be removed. Then you should find the source of the water. You should not overlook any signs of water damage on wall because they could be indicators of a bigger problem.